So I'm up here at uh, Ganchenaberry Skywalk. Um, and to be honest with you, I never realised, I never knew I was this scared of heights until I got up here. I am shitting myself. I'm trying to walk on these bloody beams because I'm too scared to step on the glass. And then I was halfway across the bloody walk and these birds started swooping me. I don't know. <laughs> They've got me cornered. Okay, let's go for a bit of a look then. Oh god, I'm freaking nervous. Beautiful views, but oh, oh look. I'm too freaking scared to just step in the middle of the glass. I'm holding onto the rail, I must look people must be bloody laughing their heads off at me. I'm like a freaking hugging the rail, trying to step on the beams, too scared to step on the glass. And, and I don't know where those birds are gone that were just freaking attacking me, but they'll probably come back any minute here now. There's some boats there off in the distance. See the Buddha monument up there on the hill. The statue. Hello. Sawadika. Sawadika. Come to Alan. Oh shit, there he is. Oh god, he's gonna start swooping me again. Look, he's bloody washing me already. Yes. Don't worry, mate, I'm scared enough bloody up here as it is. Beautiful views. Alright, let's bloody do this thing I suppose so you can have a good look before the video just keeps going and going and going. We'll take a quick lap and I'll end it and then I can just stay up here scared to myself. Oh, the nerves have gone a little bit now, I've been up here for a couple of minutes so I feel like maybe it's not a total failure. I'm not just going to fall to my death. A lot of houseboats, riverboats there. A lot of cat floating cabins, as you can see. I've, I've kind of, I've been staying in floating cabins since I've got here, uh, across a, two different, a couple of different places. See the mountains there in the distance. Basically, that's pretty much Burma on the other side of those mountains. Myanmar, Burma, whatever, whatever you want to call it. The old Burma, the new Myanmar, Myanmar. So, yeah, pretty bad civil war going along there. And those mountains too, I, I, obviously I think, you know, the tiger's near extinction, but this is apparently kind of one of the last pockets in Thailand believed to have some wild tigers, I think. Um, I think it maybe a year ago, they spotted two or three tiger cubs on a trail cam. They, they um, yeah, don't, obviously don't want to give the exact location because trophy hunting is still a thing around here with, uh, I think, uh, I think leopards? Or... But that's, um, yeah, well, that's around here as well. So, um, yeah, there we go. Beautiful yeah, thing with Buddha. Yeah, let's see how far we can zoom into Buddha. We've got the 15 Pro Max, so I should be able to get I can get a good zoom, I just can't bloody keep it stable. 15 times zoom there. Let's go back out to about two and a half, I think. I don't know ideas with cameras. I'm, the, I'm not a photographer. I try my best. I'm impatient. I don't like editing. It's just raw. What you see with me is freaking raw footage. Untouched.
So yeah, up on the skywalk here. I'm not sure how tall this is. Maybe what? 30 meters, 50 meters? Oh, it probably wouldn't be 50, would it? 30, 40? I don't know, I'm sure I could find out. Always better find out. Some of the wats, uh, temple in Thailand called Wat. And back out to one. All right. Okay, I'm getting confidence up now. I can walk normal, I'm not tugging the rail. Good. Still a bit nervous though. Let's go up here and see what's at the end and then we'll turn this video off. Oh god, I wonder what happened to those birds that were swimming. Anyway, let's not think about them right now, I suppose. Oh. You bloody, they give you shoes to wear because they, you know, I don't know, they don't want to damage the glass. The problem is my feet are too bloody big. I can't get them around my feet. I suppose that's what we forget to. Not many size 12, 13s in Southeast Asia, I suppose. Look at the mountains there, that's beautiful. I really like Canterbury. It's, it's, you know, it's probably one of my favourite spots in Thailand, Kanchanaburi, um, because of the scenery, because of the history, and it has a lot of Australian expats, so it's, as much as I don't like tourists, you know, the Australian expats are great. Old guys, retired guys, all of that. Awesome to have a chat with. But uh, yeah, so Kanchanaburi is one of my favourite areas in Thailand. I like Chiang Mai, Chiang Rai. Um, find kinds of all seem to be mountainous areas. If we're talking about islands, I guess I like Koh Samui. Beaches. Hmm. I suppose Koh Samui again, islands. Penang, Samui. Phuket. But uh, I'm not a big beach fan over here in Thailand, I suppose, because I live on the bloody beach in Australia, one of the most beautiful beaches in the world, so I don't come to Thailand for the beaches. I, I like the mountain areas. Wow, it's just amazing. So this is, uh, as I said on just one of my other videos, the river starts way, 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 way up there, near the Burma border, but not over the Burma border. Uh, it's called the the Kwe Gai, which is large river or, or Kwe large. Runs down into the Kwe Noi, which is a small Kwe, and then that runs into the Mle Kong, not the Mekong, the Mle Kong, which then runs down to the Bay of Thailand. Alright, so that's it. The Kanchanaburi Skywalk.